Hello everyone, today we're going to be talking about how to check who has access to your Google folders and documents, and then how to change that access. First, we're going to start with the folders. So you're going to come up to one of your folders, you're going to right click, and you'll notice this drop down screen. You want to go to share, and then I'll open up a new screen. Once you're here, you're going to come to the bottom right corner where it says advanced. Now. In this screen, you can see who currently has access to your folder. Right now, my folder is private. Only I can have access to it right now, but I can change that. By clicking the change button, it'll bring you to this page. Now, there are some different ones that you can pick from. You can change it to public, which that means that anyone in the, on the internet can see it. You can change it to JCISD, and this will allow anyone that has a technology consortium email to have access to it. Or you can click off specific people, and this will keep it private. All right, I'm going to keep it on private, so I'll click save. And again, we'll notice again, it says private only you can access, all right? If I want to share it with specific people, I can do that right here um, by inviting them um, via email, all right? Now, the second thing we're going to be talking about is how to um, check your access when it comes to a document. Now, when I say document, that includes a document. It could be a sheets. It could be a slides, but we're going to use a document for now. So again, you're going to right click, you're going to click share, again, come down here to the advance, and you'll see somewhat the same screen. So right now, this document that I have is private, only have I, I have access. You can come here and change it this way. Again, any of the options that we talked about before. Or you can add an email address if you want to share it with a specific person. Click done. I hope you've enjoyed this video about how to check who has access to your Google Docs and folders.